guys welcome back to our vlog I am making some pasta I'm craving for some pasta today so I am using the same egg noodles that I used before but this time it is different ways different recipe from my head so I'm just cutting some garlic red onions and I need lemon zest so I wash this lemon because we're using the zest what I do is I just get the yellow part let me push this away Ooh, I smell the lemon already so we'll just scrape it but don't put the white part because that's better so we'll just get the yellow part and then we're going to squeeze some of the juice as well we don't need a lot because it's very strong and potent potent word of the day potent <laughs> I have an audience you have question audience <laughs> potent in a sentence your kili kili smells potent <laughs> is it bastos <laughs> now you know my words <laughs> he knows what kili kili is so that's all we need just that part use just this much because I don't want it to be really sour and then I have this roasted red pepper if I can open it hey now I have the device this is the device to opening jars Please don't embarrass me. <laughs> oh well. I guess we do the the pok 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 method. The pok 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 method first. There, see? The pok pok method. <laughs> the, the banging method works. So I need a few of these. This is just red bell peppers, guys. If you cannot find this, you just uh, roast the red bell pepper. Same thing, I think. It smells really good. Mm. I wanna put more. Just rough chop it. There you go. That's all we wanted. Hey, did I drop something in my shirt? And then for the rest of our ingredients, so we have garlic, onion lemon zest lemon juice roasted red bell pepper and i already boiled the egg noodles but i only boiled it halfway because we are going to add it to our broth or the with with everything so i don't want it to cook too long and then i have beef this is rib eye and I marinated all night with just salt, pepper, and um, this the 
the bouillon, beef bouillon powder. And of course, we're gonna add more beef bouillon powder. And I have the liquid seasoning if you don't have this soy sauce, light soy sauce. And then Parmesan cheese, of course. And our usual um, olive oil and salt and pepper. So I'm going to move this on that side now. Olive oil. And I also have the um, where I boil the egg noodles, guys. We're going to get some water from that. gonna put our garlic actually the onion first not the garlic so we won't burn the garlic and I am so hungry I did not eat lunch and garlic lots of garlic Then the beef and the beef guys because it is ribeye you don't need to boil this for a long time and then squeeze the lemon Pepper Just a little bit of salt because we are going to put some of the beef bouillon powder and I put just a little bit of salt on our pasta when I boil it Our liquid, more liquid seasoning. Then we'll scoop some of the broth or the water. going to taste it if the saltiness is okay I can add a little bit more salt oh my goodness it's so yummy I'm going to put the red pepper roasted red pepper and the zest Try it again. Mm. It's so good. 
Now I'm gonna add the noodles. It looks like it needed something green. So let's add some parsley. Oh, that looks so good. And it is now ready, guys. See, that's the reason why I didn't cook the noodles all the way because I wanted to cook it on our broth so it will absorb everything all the flavors oh it smells so good and it is done all you need to do is transfer it. Then the Parmesan. Delicious for the pasta lover out there, like my best friend. <laughs> she loves pasta. That's the death of me. Pasta. For me, I have to crave for it in order for me to have pasta. Put some beef, we'll put some of the pepper and more cheese, more cheese, please. It always excites me to taste the food that I made. <laughs> Especially for the ones that I do, I did it for the first time. So you twist your pasta this way. Let's try the just the pasta first. Ay, wow, it's hot. Wow. I'm gonna save some for Suzette so she can taste it. We're gonna see each other on Friday. We're gonna go out to eat. Or maybe I'm gonna stop by tomorrow so she can taste it. The noodles, it's cooked perfectly. And the saltiness, is so perfect and I can taste the um, the lemon and the lemon zest you can taste it but it's not overpowering and uh, this thing will taste the pepper red pepper It's like restaurant quality. What time is it? 5.45. Grace, you wanna get some of this? Huh? <laughs> I'm, I'm watching something that's in my ear. 
Oh, okay. Okay. Oh my god. I said, do you want to get some of the food? Okay. It's so good, my gosh. This pepper is so good. So let's eat it with without the meat, it's already so delicious. He's gonna get his food now. <laughs> the pot is mine though. All <laughs> well, the pot is mine. Oh my goodness. That's so yummy. Maybe I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna call Suzette and tell her. <laughs> I'll give her some. Here, Parmesan. Parmesan Reggiano. Okay, have some, have some and let me know. <laughs> Who doesn't want to be in the camera, guys? <laughs> oh my goodness, I think I need to stop so I can enjoy. Enjoy it and I'm going to like savor it and all the good stuff. Sobrang sarap. Sobrang sarap daw. Sobrang sarap means very delicious. So guys, try it and you'll see for yourself. See for yourself. If you don't have the roasted, um, this one right here, roasted red pepper, you can just buy the uh, red bell pepper and you um, burn it on the stove. Burn it on the stove. You you uh, roast it on the stove, like directly to the stove. It's the same thing if you cannot find this. But anyway, guys, that's our dinner for tonight. First time making this. We bought this from uh, Home Goods a long time ago and I forgot about it. Yes, guys, thank you so much for watching. For all of you guys new to this channel, welcome to Win's Life. I hope you all stay. And um, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you again, guys, on our next vlog. Bye for now. Mwah.